run for the shadows. There's plenty of shadows on Droman Kass. Kass City. It feels so strange and unnatural to be in this Imperial architecture using this Imperial lift as Janata. The new Sith Empire. Look at this. Droman Kos. Diplomats, soldiers, and Sith. City out there. This is all quite cool. Nice big interactive galaxy map. Whoa. What do you want now, old man? <laughs> Droman Kars. I clung to this world for too long before I cast it aside as a failed experiment. I defeated you here. You didn't cast it aside. I fought you and drove your spirit into hiding. I had already shifted my focus to Sakul many centuries before your victory here. Uh huh. This is the empty husk I left behind. But the Sith could still be a useful tool to help you seize the Eternal Throne. Honored guests, welcome to Dromund Kass. Moff Lorman. It's Minister Lorman now. Really? I figured your career was over after you lost the Ascendant Spear. Well, this story sounds too good to pass up. Back in my SIS days, I may have blown up a prototype Sith warship. Lorman was the deputy commander. It's Minister Lorman, and the past is irrelevant. I serve Empress Asina now. She awaits us in the throne room. All right. Can't wait to see this throne room. Welcome, Commander. These are strange times. Did you ever imagine the Sith would negotiate with a Jedi? I hope you're able to move beyond your prejudice. In the past, arrogance would have blinded us to our flaws. Now we understand admitting weakness is the first step in eliminating it. I urge you not to be so critical, Empress. The Sith Empire has always been glorious. <laughs> This is a I would like to continue this conversation on my personal shuttle. Just the two of us, speaking freely. That's a risk I'm willing to take. It may not be wise to split up. She's probably pretty formidable, but don't count me out just yet. I can handle myself if she tries anything. Will you two be okay if I leave you with Lorman? It's Minister Lorman! Minister Lorman! <laughs> Is that so hard to remember? This fucking Don't guy. Don't worry about us, Commander. You're right. I'm sorry. I regret what happened. <laughs> oh, Empress Asina, wait for me. Oh, that's cool. How they bow for her as she walks by.
Got a pretty brisk walk there. I call bullshit. How is she so far ahead of me? Better than bowing down to the eternal empire, right? I remember when everyone used to bow down. This is our shuttle. I feel like it would be a diplomatic error to board before the Empress. Oh, that's a cool shot. Look at this. There remain Sith who do not approve of the alliance I offer. They hold tight to the old ways. But to stop Valen, we must work together. Taking her down is all that matters. I welcome any help I can get. This does not end with Valen. We both know there is only one path to victory. You want to seize the Eternal Throne, and I will help you. Why me? You don't want the throne for yourself? I am focused on the survival of my people. Unchecked, Valin will grind us into dust. I am not powerful enough to stop her. You are, with my help. The fact that she's focused on the- oh shit! Engine's non-responsive, we need to bring it down. Sabotage? How could this happen? Bail out! Whoa! Holy shit! And now there are jungle beasts? Huh. What I was gonna say is that the fact that the Sith Empress is even concerned with the survival of her people puts her head and shoulders above Valkorion. Ah! Impressive, Commander. It's good to know your reputation is not exaggerated. It's good to know we're both in the Purple Gang. You handle yourself well in a fight. I can pilot a shuttle, too, unless someone sabotages it. She's a cool-ass Emperor. Probably the same person jamming our comm signals. I'm telling you, it's that Minister Lorman. Yep, exactly. Lorman's behind this. I know it. Lorman lacks both the courage and competence to orchestrate a direct attempt on my life. My shuttle has an emergency beacon. The signal should cut through any interference. If help is coming, that's where they'll be. I thought this was going to be a diplomatic mission, so I wore my nice robes. Now I'm in the muddy-ass woods. Lana's going to sense that something's wrong. Just about into the main network. Someone's coming. <laughs> Try to look casual. Forgive the intrusion, but I come bearing tragic news. The Empress's shuttle has crashed. Crashed where? Somewhere in the jungle. Unfortunately, the emergency locator is not transmitting. That's uh, you, impossible. snake. Not if the shuttle disintegrated. I'm afraid there's only one logical conclusion: the Empress and Commander are dead. Try not to sound so happy about it. Oh, come on, guys, you're not going to fall for this. All 
right, we're gonna do some, uh... Oh, nice, with the cairns. We're gonna do some reverse spelunking. Come with me, Empress. I learned how to do this on Odessa. Woo! Man, these... Look at all the moss growing on these rocks. It must be really slippery, honestly. Deadly predators stalk these wilds. You could say the same thing about your cities. City predators won't eat our remains. Usually. <laughs> yeah, those vine cats are pretty vicious. Try and give them a wide berth. We are going in here. For the Alliance. dead end, after all. Whoa, what happened here? That's, that's not an Imperial, that's a Mandalorian. I like how they've upped the ante with these, uh, these weather effects, you know? Roman Kos has always been like a moody, stormy world, but they really dialed it up. I like it. The storms are fierce today. It will make a rescue attempt difficult. I never liked relying on others to save me anyway. A sound <laughs> philosophy, one the Sith Code embraces. I love this. Janata's just like bonding with the Sith Emperor right now. Watch out, lightning strikes. I wonder if, if Empress Asina got hit with a lightning strike, if it would like power her up. I love this. Look how much the trees are shaking and moving in the wind. Cool, there's already a rescue team at the shuttle crash. Slogging through the forest to hunt you down was gonna be the worst part of this job. Oh shit, this isn't a rescue party. when the targets come to us. Oh shit, they've got HK units too. You must know who we are. Do you really think you can beat us? The Geno Herodin fear no one. Not even you. The Geno Aridon? I thought you were just a myth. That's because we never leave witnesses. Fine, be that way. Where'd she go? Where'd she go? It's just because every time you fail, you don't leave witnesses. The 
beacon destroyed, comm signals still jammed, and a fierce storm coming our way. Even the weather is trying to kill us. <laughs> we could take refuge in the Geno Haradan camp if we can find it. It's likely the camp is heavily guarded. Look at this as an adventure. That is not reassuring. <laughs> this is awesome. This is a fun dynamic I did not expect. These two pairing up. Looks like the storm's not letting up anytime soon. I say we grab a shuttle and head out now. The interference will disable comms and scanners. Not to mention the risk of an electrical surge frying our circuits. Sean, I just heard the news. Let me express my sincere condolences. SIS reporting has gone downhill since I left. The commander is missing, not dead. Don't let foolish hope blind you. You are leaderless, as are the Sith. Someone must step in to fill the void. And I suppose you think that's you, cousin. Former Republic Chancellor. You've already served your term. True leaders don't need titles to hold power. I want what your leader wanted, to defeat Valen. Join me, and we can finish what she started. Pass. I've had more than my fill of working with you. You're still grieving. Eventually, you'll realize I'm right. Storm be damned. The time for patience is past. Let's find the commander. Good. Well, at least they are confident I'm still alive. That's, uh, it's troubling information that my good-for-nothing cousin, Suresh, is now trying to get in on the action. That can only lead to bad things. A small part of me is enjoying this. <laughs> As Empress, I'm rarely able to test my martial skills anymore. I prefer to lead by example. Stay on the front lines. Among the Sith, being on the front there? lines just makes it easier for someone to stab you in the back. It's true. Well, I guess that, that answers my question. Close. The lightning strikes can be deadly out here. If we recalibrate the electrical towers, they will draw in the power of the storm and keep us safe. How am I supposed to get across? I guess I cross here. I'm gonna use this Jurgaran to cushion my landing. Watch this. Alright, that did not actually work. Which is stranger, that the Geno Haridan are real, or that they're hunting us? We should be flattered. The Geno Haridan only accept contracts worthy of their skills. This is one compliment I could do without. I hear you. So where's the scout? There you are. That's going to concentrate the lightning, and it'll save us from getting zapped. Where did you come from? Is 
out, but I can do this. Being a Jedi sure is convenient sometimes. Hey, what you working on there, buddy? Both lightning towers are set, and we have enough navigational data to find the Genoharadan camp. Let's go. I fear the storm is getting worse. Good. It'll cover our approach to the Genoharadan camp. I see why the Alliance follows you. Where others see problems, you see opportunity. Thank you. I feel like we didn't really need to collect navigational data to know that their camp was going to be in the next, the, the closest structure. <laughs> Here we go. bodies at the crash site. The Cena, the Alliance commander. No, our people. That means the targets are still out there. Find them. Oh, there's the other one up there. Actuator restraint cannon. Okay. Restraints. Let's try it out on this guy. Oh shit. That's pretty that's pretty effective. Status report. Any sign of the targets? No visual contact yet. Hard to track them through the storm. Rain's wiped out the trail. Keep looking. Find them before they find us. A little late for that. We've definitely found you now. I 
suppose the shuttle was too much to hope for. I found something. It's not enough to simply crash the shuttle. I want to see the bodies. No bodies, no bonus. Mother Chancellor Suresh, that Republic snake. Suresh is no longer in charge of the Republic. True, but intelligence. I can't believe that bitch. Significant power. Ah. Into the temple. Run. Oh shit! All right, we can't get out that way. Man, my own cousin trying to murder me. I'm sure there's another way out. Looks like we have some exploring to do. Lead the way, Commander. Reports from Drone and Cass claim the Outlander is dead. No. Father's spirit is still rattling around in there. His little pet is alive. Yeah, she'll know if I die because she has that force connection to her father. The have thrown the Alliance into disarray. Now is the perfect time to strike. Odessan is too heavily defended. That doesn't change just because their precious Outlander is missing. Odessa is not the target. Are you going to strike Drum and Koss? Find a way out of the tomb. Oh man, they're still blasting the building up there. Tomb horror. Oh god. held the secrets to immortality. I was wrong. You seem to have found a way. The body is just a shell, a vessel for the spirit. Emperor of the Sith was my first face, but it is merely one of many I have worn. Clearly you weren't satisfied just being the Sith Emperor. The Sith Empire was too corrupted for me to save. But Sakul, Sakul was different. I saw potential in the primitive world, so I raised it to perfection. You speak of Sakul as though it's your favorite child. The Eternal Empire deserves more than my children ever did. When you take the throne, you will understand. We still need to go deeper if we hope to find another passage to the surface. Sometimes the only way up is down. Baywan, now's not a good time. This can't wait. Suresh just sent a message. She's heading here to Odessa. What? Seems she didn't wait for us to change our minds after all. Send her pack in the second she lands. Some of the troops want to hear her out. They aren't sure the alliance can last. Oh there God! Rumors about the command. They're starting to Remember fracture. Where their loyalties lie. Stall Suresh. We're on our way. All right. Well, if they're headed to Odessa, that means they're not about to. Oh no. This is all going wrong. Look at that thing. Oh, 
shit, what the fuck? Ah! No! Excuse me? I was not expecting some Temple of Doom bullshit. <laughs> okay. I'll watch my step this time. Oh, that's cool. I always got tentacles poking out like that. There we go. Deeper. This reminds me of my earliest trials as an apprentice. Clearing vermin from tombs on Corriban. Sounds like you missed those days. It was a simpler time. But I am not nostalgic for the past. I see a glorious future for us both. That's cool. It's good to know that Empress Asina started off as a level one just like everyone else. Alright, let's not fall into the spike pit. are revered on Droman Kass. But to move forward, we must abandon the old ways. Easy to say, harder to do. I understand your skepticism, but I will prove myself to you in time. This looks like uh, an artifact. It's part of the Ark of the Covenant. Oh, that's an artifact. Sith whispers. We're getting deep. Janata Teros wonders to herself just how deep this temple goes, but also thinks maybe she doesn't want to know the answer. Okay. I recognize these guys from the hollows. To make me come out in a storm like this. We should just seal the passage behind us, trapping you in here forever. Not an option. Suresh wants the corpses. No bodies, no bonus. Wouldn't want to upset your new boss, would you, Lorman? It's Minister Lorman, <laughs> and I don't answer to Suresh. We're partners. Mm hmm Don't do this. There's still <coughs> time to make things right. The Alliance commander is more merciful than I am. I would listen to her. It's not Lorman's call. The Geno Harridan always finished the job. Look at him run. Yes. Where the opponents are so hard to find. And so fun to kill. Feel my rock. I brought them right to you. Now finish them. Oh, 
Ah, Jesus Christ, it's a lot of fire. Where's Lorman? <laughs> you fucked Stay up. Back. I've taken your friends hostage. Anything happens to me and they're dead. This is Minister Lorman. Let me speak to the prisoners. Yeah, Lana. Man, you suck at everything. <laughs> this is who you sent to capture us? I'm a little offended. Sounds like you had some excitement on your end. Nothing we couldn't handle. It's good to hear your voice. Where exactly do you think you're going? I knew you weren't dead. Never doubted it for a second. Yeah, we need to stop Suresh. Suresh is behind this. Has she attempted to reach you? She's done more than that. Suresh wants the Alliance, Commander. She's on Odessa as we speak. Hold tight. I'm on my way. You are my guest. Would you like to execute the traitor, or should I? Janata really wants to appease this new ally in Empress Asina, but also just like can't see her way clear to just executing this guy in cold blood. It's time to embrace new methods, Empress. Be merciful, and you'll have a loyal servant for life. Unsatisfying, but I will try it your way. She walks the light path, always. As for you, never again, you hear me? God. I mean, if anything, Lorman just, like, hastened the bond between me and the Empress being trapped in this situation. He made the Alliance even more likely to happen. Oh, there's Suresh. Arrived on Odessa. Members of the Alliance, as many of you have already heard, your commander is dead. Lies. Yes. Got here just in time. There are dark times ahead. But fear not. I have come to offer you a beacon. <laughs> that face. Yeah, you better run, cousin. Oh, this is great. You know everything, then. I don't understand. Why go through all this? Are you working for Valen? I want to destroy Valen, and you're not fit to lead the Alliance. I am. I saw an opportunity, and I took it. I won't apologize for that. We are well beyond apologies. 
What do we do with her? Execution, I expect. It's what Valen would do. It's what I would do. That's the difference between us. You get to live. Though you'll be in an Alliance prison for a long, long time. Take her away. You have no idea how happy I am. <laughs> Empress Asino is waiting for your call, Commander. We'll meet you in the war room. All right. Ever since, like, we were kids. Never believed you were really dead, Commander. Not even for a second. Can't con a con artist, right? By the way, if anyone contacts you asking about a life insurance policy that paid out in your name, <laughs> say you don't know me, okay? God damn it, Galt. Many thanks. <laughs> Suresh has always been jealous of Janata. Finally took it too far. Good to see you back in one piece, Commander. Don't know what the Alliance would do without you. Many thanks. Seeing you standing here, alive and well, I can't believe I almost fell for Suresh's lies. Welcome home, Commander. You get a hug, Vet. You're the best one. Alright. Oh, there's the thingy. Brief me on the situation, folks. Apologize for everything on Drone and Cuss, but I still believe we should unite your people with mine. Absolutely, you're super cool. You've proven yourself, Asina. I accept your offer. That doesn't mean you're home free. We're watching you. Also fair. Knowing Theron, not even your Hollownet activity is safe. Remind me to change my access codes. <laughs> I look forward to working with you. Meanwhile. This is the cargo freighter, Rodella. Does anybody copy? Oh shit. Gravestone. Man, the gravestone's terrifying. It doesn't even need the Omni Cannon. We got your back, Rodella. You okay? I've taken heavy damage. Need to make emergency repairs. Roger that, Rodella. We'll bring your freighter on board. Just hold tight. Much appreciated, Cot. Looking forward to meeting you in person. God damn it. Should have known. Yeah, if they take out the gravestone, it's that's bad news bears for all of us. Okay, and that's the uh, that's the end of chapter 2. Awesome. This was really cool. Um I am very surprised that Suresh would take it as far as she did, trying to trying to usurp me like that. I'm not about to go having my own cousin executed, all right? This isn't Game of Thrones, even though she did cross me, and I'm sure Theron will be very happy to check up on her from time to time in the uh, the Republic jail cells. Yeah, that was great. Um, I'm going to dive right into Chapter 3, so thanks for watching, guys, and as always, may the Force be with you. <laughs>